But first, the latest news poll data is illuminating on a number of fronts with support for Labor nosediving among a number of demographics. A strong swing to the coalition that was unexpected, well, unexpected if you listen to the so-called political analysts who are forever advising the coalition to lean left and not have strong conservative leaders like Peter Dutton. Let's look at the breakdown by age. You can see support for the Greens is really only evident among the youngest voters. One in four voters under 34 are opting for the Greens. That's frightening. That number, though, reduces fairly dramatically for those who are aged uh, between 35 to 49. That's 15%. And it dips further in the next age bracket to just 7%. Among the over 65s, only 2% are backing the Greens. And Greens are also most popular with the unemployed, those listed as not working. Among those who are in full-time work or who are retired, the Greens have the least amount of support, whilst those who work part-time or are unemployed or not working have much higher rates for the Greens. The gender breakup is also interesting, with women leaning centre-left while men lean centre-right and an increasing number turning their back on the Albanese government. And support for the federal Labor has also plummeted in Western Australia. The state-by-state -state data, also fascinating, the coalition now ahead in New South Wales, uh, sorry, ahead in Western Australia and drawn level in New South Wales for the first time since the last federal election.